I'm Steve from This Week With Cars, and today I'm down at the Sunbeam United International Sunbeam Show. Today we're doing an autocross. I'm going to be taking my 1966 Sunbeam Tiger to that. The autocross is going to be held at a very cool facility here in Independence, Missouri. This might be one of the best autocross venues in the United States. So let's get over there. Well, here we are. We are at the Blue River Precision Driving Center. This area is used for training the police and other emergency services. This is a gigantic concrete pad, but we're actually not using that. They actually have an urban uh, track area where they can design different courses, and that's what we'll be using for the autocross today. So it should be fast, and it should be nice because we'll be able to tell where we're going. At least a whole lot easier than a course completely built out of a parking lot. This will be kind of fun because this is the first time that I'm autocrossing my Tiger and my dad also brought his Tiger that he's owned for uh, about 50 years now. I definitely have more horsepower and his brakes feel a little bit better than mine but of course horsepower doesn't mean a whole lot in an autocross so we'll see what happens. And here's my dad's car, the one I'm going to be competing against, They're both in the same class of modified Tiger. This one has a Hypo 289 in it, compared to my 347. So right now we're doing our course walk. They gave us big chunks of drywall and they're making us uh, mark the cones so that if they get displaced, we'll know if they've been moved too far. Okay, we've got grid ready. This first row is all modified tigers. That's where I'm at. I'm right there. My dad is right there, third. Behind that is everything else roots. And that looks like a much bigger class at the moment. I am kind of surprised because I thought there was more modified tigers than anything else, but I might be wrong. Also at the autocross with us today is a very special car. This is the one of the 1962 Sebring Sunbeam Alpines. This was one of the factory team cars. It's really great to see this car out here. Here's an interesting modification on the Tiger next to me. They Frenched in the rear license plate. Should just be mounted right on the back of the deck lid like you see on mine right there. And if you're taking video, pictures in the car, whatever is doing it.
I can't find my watch. It got ripped right off of my arm when it caught the seatbelt. Wondering if it went out the window. run was a 46.3 my dad just had a 59.5 so I've been taking a second off every run and my dad's been getting better as well I just uh, took a walk out here on the track they let me come out here right after that last run I did find my watch it was lying on the pavement right there it's cracked definitely has been run over you can see that it just broke that pin right there that pin is bent just ripped right off my arm but it is still working I don't know if you can see that finally connected to my phone my phone's trying to alert me now guess I need to remember to take these off when I'm doing an autocross
Well, I had a lot of fun today. I believe that I came in third overall, but we will not find out the results until the banquet tomorrow. I think I was second in class, losing out to this tiger right here, which is running Hoosier Slicks on it. And I also think that the turbo BMW powered uh, Hillman Imp or Sunbeam Imp uh, also beat me to take the second fastest time overall. Well, I had a lot of fun today. And of course, if you had fun watching this video, comment below and click subscribe.